has this very like dark comedic lens on these classic Disney tales. Look at Tori, oh my gosh. She looks like she just got out of church. We are very excited to have you here, and we flew you here from across the country because you answered that Jeopardy question about us. All sorts of folks watch things on the Fine Brothers channel where this five-letter verb is in every video title. Allie. What is React? I'm so happy to be here. This is probably the coolest thing I've done since Jeopardy, if not cooler. Cool. You ready to get into and react to something? I think so. I hope so. If you've ever wondered... <gasps> it's Pete! This guy is still doing this sh**. <gasps> oh my gosh, I remember this. I reacted to him on Teens React. He's just as talented as before. Which movies is he gonna do? I've seen the first two of these and it's just so cool. He's so creative. Beatboxing. This reminds me of Pentatonix. I like it. Ah, this stuff is so good. Well, your little mane's been lion tamed by beasts who don't fight fair. See, it sounds cute, and then he gets into like the darkness. This guy kind of like ruins Disney. Now I dread my severed head might end up on your wall. Oh. Let me help this African economy. Oh no! Don't hunt Simba. So talented. I don't think Hamlet ended up this way. Oh, I like that he mentioned the Hamlet reference. Not a lot of people know that it was inspired by Hamlet. I wonder how many hours he puts into this. His facial expressions too, like wow, he should be on React. He'd be great at this. Holy <laughs> sh every time I Peter Pan. Peter Pan and like clanking are some of my favorites. Now I've been stuck at age 16 for 80 years of puberty. And I'm yeah, that doesn't sound fun. <laughs> He's so creative. He has this very like dark comedic lens on these classic Disney tales. He's a bright, he's a bright, he's a bright. Hope he's by. He's a bright. I wonder how many times it took him to get this just right. Because it just is so good. Oh, Hercules was my favorite movie as a kid. Oh, that's my favorite Disney movie. Oh, okay, so no more believing in gods. It's now like Christianity. <laughs> <laughs> Roman history, Greek. <laughs> People stop caring about Hercules. <laughs> the high notes, so good. He has such a nice voice. Threw him in the Colosseum, a lion a la Oh, he's so good. With people that do videos that like go on for a long time, but it's like the same format, the quality just gets better and better and better as the years go along. It's pretty much the same format, but I mean, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. I'm a prisoner. Aladdin! Isis blew up my seat. Okay, yeah, this one's very dark. I'm surprised Disney hasn't been telling YouTube to take this down. I like guys a holy war. Oh no. A hundred thousand children please. This just took things to a whole different level. Sharia law. Jesus Christ. God gives no fuck. Unholy war. Just I just, I don't know if I should cry or if I should laugh. Head of bands for you and me. The lions are it's the Lion King. Peter Pan, Hercules, and Scrooge. Aladdin. Damn, that's a that's a throwback. Oh my god, that that's 
that blows my mind. He puts so much effort into them, so much creative talent that he has to think of. It's really impressive. That took me on a ride. That was a lot to take in. There was so much like humor and wit and like even politics was thrown in there. He just did it so flawlessly. So that was the video After Ever After 3 by creator John Cozart, AKA Paint. Yeah, I don't even know like how I first stumbled across the first one, but I think, you know, it, be it was like a pretty viral video. The series has been incredibly successful dating back five years now with the first two entries getting over 50 million views each on YouTube and this latest entry getting millions of views in its first week. Oh my gosh, the first two ones that he did, I'm obsessed with them and I know them all by heart. So what do you think it is about the series that works? I I think like, okay, well obviously you can put like real life problems with Disney music, like that's how everyone wants their news. <laughs> that's how like everyone wants to be told the truth. Those songs are just instantly recognized. I haven't seen any of those movies in probably 10 years, but like the moment you hear those songs, like you know it right away. So. He's obviously trying to get people to not just listen to songs, but like think about what they're listening to. Disney, like everyone has that nostalgia and then to take those songs that everybody loves and kind of subvert them and warp them in a way that like you listen to the lyrics and it makes you think and you're like, oh yeah, he kind of has a point. So something special about this episode of College Kids React is that many of the people in this episode have reacted to After Ever After at some point. Wow, we're all growing up. We actually have a photo of oh my our cast <laughs> previously reacting to After Ever After. Oh no, I was probably a fetus. Oh my God, look at my hair and my face. I still have that shirt and I still wear it all the time. Tori obviously looks so different. I feel like I don't really look that different, except I don't wear glasses anymore. Oh, so look at Tori, oh my gosh. She looks like she just got out of church. And Maddie, oh Maddie, that's, that's like, she looks like a baby. Oh my God, we're babies. When I watched that, I was kind of just like, super into the like, oh my God, this is where I'm getting into dark comedy. I've been doing React since they were doing it in the Fine Bros apartment. And now they have this huge building and like a whole crew and cast. Life has changed so much since then. But you know, I still enjoy quality music and Paint's music still makes me very happy. There are a lot of classic YouTube series that are still going despite being many years since their first entry. <laughs> some are posted every day while some have huge gaps in between episodes and as college kids you're part of the first generation that really grew up with YouTube. Mm -hmm. What is it like growing up with some of these series and creators that have been around since you were like a lot younger? I, I mean it's pretty cool it's also it's awesome seeing like who's evolved. The most interesting thing is that like the content itself evolves along with the YouTubers. Before YouTube was a huge thing entertainment was just things that you see on TV or these big studio movies, but now it just gives power to independent artists and creators. I loved how fresh and new YouTube was at that time because it was just like, anybody can make what they want. Like it's this format where you're free range to do whatever you want. Cause then you see where it's at now and you see people making full careers out of it, a whole company out of it. If there's a TV show on TV like that, runs for a really long time you like and you watch it consistently you grow up with the characters and you relate to them and they're just a part of your life i'm sure a lot of people my age feel that way about the different youtube channels and series that they've watched so finally if there ever was to be an after ever after four what disney movie would you hope is included oh my gosh i feel like he would have to do moana the main song i feel like that would be great tarzan probably was probably my second favorite disney movie son of man a great song, I think you could do a lot with that. He hasn't covered Mickey and Minnie, actually, like the big two themselves, so he can do that. He, he's got he's got more than part four. Moana, there's a lot about like exploitation of native peoples and like resources that being stolen. If he ever did an After 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 on Up, I feel like he would end up talking about how like the old man died and then maybe like the little boy now is all messed up because of his previous adventures. Oh my God, now I really want it. Please do your next one on up. Thanks for watching this magical episode of College Kids React and shout out to Bad Fox 12 and Random Vids. Subscribe and hit that bell if you want to live happily ever after. See ya. Hey everybody, Ethan here from my feed. Thanks for watching College Kids React. If you want to see more from John Colzer, be sure to subscribe to his channel right over there.